New at 11, a show of solidarity from thousands on the Hawthorne Bridge. They gathered to send the message that there is no room for hate in the Rose City. This came in response to the attack on a gay couple a week ago that happened as they held hands while crossing that same bridge. Good evening to you. I'm Anna Canzano. K2's Tim Gordon joins us live. And Tim, you saw this whole demonstration unfold tonight. Quite a turnout. It really was an amazing turnout, Anna, for an event that was first publicized about 72 hours ago on Facebook. Now, 2,000 people said they'd show up for Hands Across a Hawthorne, and we looked it up, and it looks like about twice as many showed up. They came out for these two young men, people standing up against discrimination. 23-year-old Brad Forky knows this isn't just about the violence against him or his boyfriend, Christopher. Tonight's event and your presence here is about everyone this has happened to and everyone that it will happen to in the future. The massive group made its way hand in hand onto the Hawthorne Bridge, filling it on both sides, crossing the Willamette, promoting love, decrying hate. Because Portland isn't that city. Portland is a city that really supports its citizens. I've been married to my partner for um, a couple years now. And, you know, to have the support of the community when things are, you know, going the way they did a week ago is important. These are big steps forward. The chain is looking great, guys. From what happened to a gay couple who crossed this bridge last week. It's terrible that uh, there wasn't a more immediate response to the distress. And I, I really, it's really important for people to turn out and show solidarity. <laughs> Solidarity in the belief that everyone has the right to love and deserves to be loved. Now, this event was sponsored by the Q Center, Basic Rights Oregon, local churches, and others. The five men who attacked Brad Fortner and Christopher Rosevere have not been arrested yet. Live in Southeast Portland, Tim Gordon, K2 News. Anna. Notably, uh, Sam Adams making his presence there, known as uh, our mayor as well. Tim Gordon, thanks so much for your report.